Hey guys, welcome to the 8th Autodesk Inventor tutorial and in this tutorial I'm going to be showing you how to make text 3D or have it engraved into something. So I'm going to show you how to have text like coming out of this surface right here and how to engrave it into this surface so it'll be going into it. Alright, so the first thing that you're going to want to do is obviously have a 3D object. I just have this uh, rectangle right here, rectangular prism. And what you're going to want to do is just select a side, right click on it and say new sketch because we're just going to be drawing uh, text on this surface right here. Alright, so I'm just going to rotate the view so that I'm looking head on to this uh, feature right here. And then I'm just going to grab some text, so just go up to the text tool, draw your uh, rectangle that your text will be inside of. Uh, then when this dialog pops up, just go ahead and type the text inside of here that you want to be uh, on the side of your uh, shape. And I'm just going to make it say Adam, but you can make it say anything you want. And I'm just going to make it be positioned in the center, so it will be in the center of that uh, rectangle that I created. And then I'm just going to move this text so it's about in the center of that uh, rectangle that I created. Alright, perfect. So once you have your text in the correct location and all formatted properly, just go ahead and click Finish Sketch. Alright, so now let me rotate our uh, object right here. We can see that that text right there is right on the side of that face, but it's not 3D. So to make it 3D, we're just going to actually use the Emboss tool. So just go up to this tool right here and go ahead and click it. Alright, now the first thing that you want it wants you to select is the profile. And that's basically what we're going to be embossing, or what we're going to be making 3D. And that's going to be the text that we created. So we're just going to go ahead and select this text. Alright, and now this is the depth. So basically how uh, wide you want your text to be. I'm just going to keep it 0.1 so it's not going to come out too far. And then I'm just going to go ahead and click OK. And as you can see right there, it just made that text 3D. Just made it pop out from the surface right there. And there are a lot of different things you can do with the emboss feature. Um, we just go ahead and uh, edit our feature right here. We can see that we can change the color of the face of our text. So if we want to just click this right here, uh, we can change the color to anything we want. Uh, I'm just going to go ahead and make it, I guess, metal-gold. So gold, click OK on that, click OK on this, and now when it embosses it, we see that the top face of our text is that gold color. Perfect. Alright, so now I showed you how to make it pop out from a surface, but what about engraving it into a surface? So what you're going to want to do is just go ahead and right click on your emboss feature and click edit feature then, and then we just get our emboss dialog right here. So instead of having it adding material to our uh, feature right here, what we want it to do is actually take material away. So we're going to go ahead and select this icon right here, so engrave from the face. So basically put it into this uh, rectangle right here. And the direction is, this just means it's coming out from the face, meaning it's just going to remove nothing because there's nothing there. So we want it to take material away from the actual face, so we're going to have the direction be this way. And then we're just going to go ahead and click OK. And as you can see, it just removed material, and now there's like a hole where Adam would be. So that's perfect. And again, you can obviously edit the depth to anything you want. So if we just wanted to make the depth like a whole inch right there, then we would see that now it's engraved very deep in there. I can't even see the back right now. All right, so that's pretty much it for this tutorial on using uh, the emboss tool. So see you guys.